all of us need to type something from time to time. Not all of us are very proficient when it comes to the keyboard typing. There is an alternative that I love, and that is voice typing. In today's video, I want to show you how voice typing works with Google Docs, both on the web and on your mobile device. But first, let's take a look at some of the commands you can use, especially on the web, because not all of these works if you are on your mobile. First, we have some punctuation commands that you can use, and they are very useful when you need to have a somewhat formatted document done. And the most common are period, comma, exclamation point, question mark, new line, and new paragraph. On the web, all of those work excellent. On the mobile, the new line and new paragraph doesn't work that well. But since you are probably on your phone, it's so easy to use your finger and just click on the down arrow to get to the point where you want to be. Then we have a lot of edit commands. I don't use them usually when I'm voice typing because I always want to go in and double check my document when I'm done. So most of the editing is done afterwards. But a couple is good to know. Delete or delete last word, for example. You can delete and then say a whole group of words that you want to delete. I will have a link down in the description to a document with the most common words used for formatting as you voice type. But now let's take a look at the website and see how it works. Here I have an empty blank document and to start my voice typing I go up to tools. Third from the bottom you have voice typing. The first time you click here, it will ask you to choose your input device, your microphone. And as you can see, this little gray microphone pops up on the side of your document. You can set your language here by clicking the little down arrow next to English. I will keep it at English to have some text to use for today's voice typing. I'm just gonna read to you the about section of my YouTube channel. To start, I just click on the little microphone and it will turn red. Are you curious about how to use the internet and social media better? Question mark. New line. I make videos for beginners about the internet and social media, comma. Delete about the internet and social media, comma, building a website and forward slash or a blog, comma, how to create a podcast, comma, and much, much more, period. New paragraph. I am Pixel Pia, comma, a 64-year-old teacher and a Swede living in the US. When I'm done, I just hit that microphone again so there you go. That's how easy you can voice type on the web. I have opened a new document on my phone and I will use the same text. And you will see that not all of the commands works as well. All I have to do to start this is to click on the microphone up above zero. I click that. Are you curious about how to use the internet and social media better? Question mark. New line. I make videos for beginners, comma, delete, about the internet and social media, comma, building a website and slash or a blog, comma, how to create a podcast, comma, and much, much more period. As you could see, there were some things that didn't work as well on the mobile. But if you just need a quick little reminder and you are okay with doing some editing afterwards, 
it works pretty well. I hope this will make your writing much easier by using voice typing. Until next time. Hej då!